As News 13's Courtney Fagley tells us, Bay County Sheriff Tommy Ford wants to make sure to give the counties uh, around us the same kind of support that we received after Hurricane Michael. Bay County Sheriff's officials are preparing to head to Franklin County and assist in Hurricane Helene recovery efforts. We have a team of uh, 20 deputies uh, that are prepared to respond at first light tomorrow to Franklin. County. Bay County Sheriff Tommy Ford is the chairman of the Florida Sheriff's Task Force. He's been working with sheriffs across the state to devise emergency responses to areas severely impacted by Helene. We are working uh, those plans and have been all week uh, to um, ensure that the sheriffs in these affected counties have the help that they need uh, w when this storm passes and I anticipate that to be a massive response. The Bay County Sheriff's emergency response team is leaving for Franklin County as soon as weather conditions allow and they're making sure they come prepared. We're packing up all that equipment that we'll, we'll take over there. We'll need high water vehicles and ATVs um, and other equipment over there as well as preparing those deputies to be self-sustained for seven to 10, 10 days. Sheriff Ford is getting a lot of practice at organizing hurricane response. He oversaw the efforts following Hurricanes Ian in Fort Myers in 2022, Adalia and Perry last year, and back in Perry again this year for Hurricane Debbie. Ford says his heart goes out to those impacted by Helene, and Bay County is here to help in the aftermath. When you've gone through something like that together and see real unity and, and people looking out for each other, and uh, kind of see the best in humanity after after something like this. So there is, you know, um, there is a rainbow at the in the middle of the storm. In Panama City, Courtney Fegley, News 13, Panhandle Strong.